Hello everyone, welcome back. Um, if you look at my level bar, let's start off with that. I have experience bar, I should say. There's a level 30, and that level 30 was from caving. Um, I'll show you where I am in just a little bit here. But, oh man, I should have made a shovel. But basically we're at the um, mine shaft that I created, well, that I started the initial tunnel quite a long time ago. Um, and I got a system here for torches, so I'll it up being OCD, but don't worry. I need the F3 there, so I know what I'm doing. Um, yeah, I decided to just come and gather um, tons of resources because I kind of need resources um, before I can actually build anything. Uh, and um, I needed diamonds because, as you can see, um, I already have a sh sword, but, you know, sharpness 3. This was a level 30. Um, I got this pick. That's I'm almost done with it. This is the same one that I've already carved. Uh, you know, I'll, I'll show you the chunk that I've carved out with that single pick. Um, so, yeah, unbreaking really is quite amazing. Um, not to mention that I've done quite a bit of digging uh, on this mine shaft before I switched over to um, to these iron picks just to finish them off. So, okay. Got to get to 215 here. And torch. Anyway, um, that plan that I had for the farm at the entrance, I'll show you where, uh, what's the current status of it. But um, I think I'm going to change it a little bit because as I was digging it out, I think I have a better idea on what to do with that space. I still want to do an underground. Man, there's so much. It's kind of ridiculous actually how much uh, Yeah, uh, redstone I've found. Okay, 225. It means that here I should have something. This is the back tunnel. Um, it's kind of ridiculous how much redstone I've found down here. Uh, I'll show you guys what I've uh, harvested uh, so far. Okay, let's get this. You're done, sir. Not a lot of diamonds, though. I found a few. Not a lot, though. Which um, is unfortunate because that's probably what I need the most right now. Um, let's see here. Let me take you guys over to the farm area so we can go from there. Uh, I think, I don't know if, uh, just just come with me for this. <laughs> just let's go, I'm gonna dig a tunnel back because I think I already did it on the other side. Um, I caved the entrance. So let's do this, it's about eh, 40 blocks or so. Uh, anyway, so, since the last video, I've done a bit of work around the, um, the cave, but... Ooh, gold. Um, I, I'm starting to feel a little bit with, and I think I talked about this the last episode, uh, what um, Doc, uh, Doc M has gone through in terms of um, just people wanting to, to see him build, but at the same time... Um, the pressure of having to build on camera just takes, you know, it, it's a little bit different from uh, building off camera. I don't know why I'm using this pick. I didn't need fortune for this. Um, then building off camera and then just, you know, kind of having time to think and stuff like that. It's just the pressure of having to do it on camera changes things a little bit, which I do like. And for example, I'd love to live stream quite a bit more, but it's just um, technically infeasible right now. My computer just cannot cope with. Um, streaming and those of you who've done it know that it's quite taxing on the CPU and um, you know some of the programs actually recommend that you have a quad core or higher <laughs> so I uh, still don't have a shovel but so that live streaming is out for the time being the, um, still working on trying to get a better computer in the near future but like I've said before we'll leave that for another time um, Let's see. New things since last time. I don't even remember when the last episode was. Have I had I been to Chicago? Yet? Ooh. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, I don't know if I, I don't even know if I had been to Chicago at that time uh, with my wife, but that was a good time. Um, did not meet with Kurt J. Mack. Um, he is from that area, but <laughs> it was just Lollapalooza weekend. It was just a mess um, downtown. Not that. Uh, not that I see Kurt J. Mack actually going to Lollapalooza. He's uh, I think he mentioned that he wanted to go to the Sigur Rós concert, but because it was Lollapalooza, he didn't. 
he wouldn't go. And more redstone. Seriously. It's actually going to be good, but right now I want diamonds. Give me diamonds. Um, anything else? Anything else? Nope. I do cover everything back up, even though I'm probably going to make um, dig a second, you know, floor. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, above this one. But I just don't. I don't know. I just don't do it. Anyway, um, did I miss a torch? No, this one was at 85, so I need one at 75. One more. No, oh, right there. And here's our main tunnel. So yeah, I dig. I dug all of this just now, pretty much. I didn't have anything here, and this is the resources that I've gotten out of it. Out of it. Uh, gold. So much freaking redstone it's ridiculous um <coughs> excuse me a little tickle in my throat uh we could arrange the i wish i could have double chests for uh for rails like in a rail that'd be nice um let's get this going here and I will put, move the gold on here. Stop, you know. I'm OCD, I know. I know, you don't need to tell me. There we go. So much better. So I do have this pick. This is the other one that I enchanted. So it's pretty much like the old one. Efficiency 3, Unbreaking 3, Fortune 2. This one is just better. Fortune 3, Unbreaking 3, and Efficiency 4. So this is a beast of a pick. Unfortunately, I feel ba bad using these fortune picks just for mining these things, but you know what? I kind of have to, uh, but let's leave this out. I've, I'm have i at level 30, so might as well enchant, and that the, all those levels have been from mining, you know, just around down here, actually, just because um, it's been a, a big, big time mining, because just before I came down here, I had used, I had enchanted, uh, I think... Uh, the other uh, pick, so I still have to figure out a better way to traverse this area. But this one's not bad. Um, this one might, might this tunnel might disappear though. So <clears throat> let's see here. Ah, a little update here on the. <clears throat> excuse me again. This is not good. Uh, I updated the little the farm here just to have more trees. Basically, I have one space now. Uh, thanks, Pete, for the recommendation. Um, that would not affect. He just let me know that it would not affect the the speed of you know the yield. Uh, I still have to get rid of this because it just not does not stay. It's annoying how the leaves eat into it. Um, much better. I still have to put the pumpkins. I still have to go out to get pumpkins. And this is what I've been doing. <laughs> no TNT used. I still have to fix this area, but this was all by hand. And, and folks, this these was this area was solid. There were there were not caves. Um, this this cave ended like right here. This was me. It's just it's ridiculous. I think this is all cobble, if I'm not mistaken. Well, I've taken a lot out. Um, but so initially the, the the idea to have here was some multi level, um, you know, farm, which I'm done with that idea. I don't think I'm gonna do it just because not because I don't want that. I will build that just somewhere somewhere else. I want this to be like a more, I don't know, friendly entrance area. So I'm thinking of some sort of greenery. I have an idea. I'm just not going to do, I'm not going to talk about it too much until I build it. But um, this area here where we, you know, this path that we use to get to this down here, um, I might make it into sort of a bridge, like a wooden bridge, and have stuff that comes all the way from this side here underneath. And it goes and it fills this area here. Um, like I said, I have some ideas. It's going to take me a little bit of time um, just because it's mostly, it's, it's not very technical. It's mostly, it is nighttime. Um, it's just mostly um, looks. And I like that stuff. So I might do it um, off camera and just show you guys what's, um, what, I, what I finished. So I got a few more diamonds here. Let's enchant another pick. Try to see if I can get an unbreaking. Not that that fortune isn't bad, but, you know, ideally, actually, it would be a silk touch, I think. Um, 
Should I do this or should I go with a shovel first? Now uh, let's do another one of these. Ah, uh, here we go. Wish me luck. I'm going with the first one. Dang it! I get fortune on every single one of them. This one doesn't even have them breaking. Ah, uh, this is not good. This is not good. Okay, I might save this one instead and use the other one that has fortune and unbreaking for the big mining. This is not great, but oh well. Let's heal. I mean, fix these. Um, let's see. I'm not sure what else I can show you guys today. I needed to put an episode out, not needed from the sense of an obligation, but you know, I kind of just the expectations of people were having of uh, a more freaking episode schedule. Um, but I wanted to give you an update that you know I'm not dead. Um, I'm alive and well, thank you very much. And I've been working on stuff down here. It's just a matter of having something that I can actually show um, for. You know, I just don't want to bring you guys in for <clears throat> excuse me again um for the you know the nasty just dig in and dig through in the you know in the, in the caves down there just i know that's kind of boring um but another thing that i might do in the next episode might be a little bit more of an exploration episode just in the sense of that you know since 1.3 came out we haven't gone out to um find new areas and i might do that to try to find some emeralds or some villages or some um some of that stuff uh, actually, morning. Let's see if we can still find some mobs. I still have to fix the way to get up there. I was kind of expecting to do an elevator. I'm not so sure anymore since uh, 1.3. Whoa. Whoa. Folks. Where are you? 1.3 kind of killed the piston elevators, uh, which is incredibly frustrating. I never use my arrows either. Ah, that was an amazing shot. I don't even know how I did it. <laughs> Thought I was going to hit the trees. Um, another thing that I probably uh, have to do sometime soon is some sort of um, animal farm. Um, because I'm that's probably my main concern right now is food. I'm really, really low on food. And I have to come to the village every time I want to get farm. When I want to get wheat to make bread. Which is not bad. Um, it's just not ideal. Let me see what I did here. <clears throat> I did put doors back. And since I only had two villagers left, like I showed you guys last time, I don't. I really don't know what happened to the other ones. I got them to come in here and just lock the door. So now the, the zombies, when they come for the siege, how many villagers do we have in there? I put two in there. One, two. That's it? Only three, huh? At least... No, 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 no. There's four. Is that the max number for this uh, space? These number of doors here? I have to check that again. But the good thing is, because I did that, you know... Whoa, this door is kind of nasty. Um, the zombies don't attack any other house. They don't. They don't break the doors because... Uh, the villagers are there and the door is locked. So all they come here in the, during a siege, they come over here and they just, you know, I want to get in. I want to get in. I want to eat some villagers. Um, but they can't. I got, you know, doors here just for safety. I'm going to take this this time. I have tons of wheat back home. I think I have one of each. No, I think I have two farmers, don't I? Wank, wank, wank. Uh, let's see. Actually, I could. Yeah, I don't know. I don't care about that. Um, so I think I'm gonna keep this episode a little bit shorter. Um, I hope you guys like the new uh, intro little thingy. Uh, it took me a little bit to do. I think I've nailed the logo the way I want it, and I'll just keep it that way for now. Um, leave some feedback on the episode, but also on that intro if you like it or not. Um, I don't know if you guys watch uh, Twitch, you know, stuff on Twitch at all, but if you do, I have a Twitch account, and if you go to my channel homepage now, I have more links, you know, to Steam, um, Raptor, you know, whatever, all these social networks and uh, platforms, so 
make sure to follow me there so that if I do stream at some point on a barred computer or something, you get notified, um, which I might do sometime this weekend. I don't know. Uh, I might make it into a weekend tradition to go to um, use a different computer to stream a little bit. So keep that in mind. Um, do that. Thanks so much for um, just the feedback that I've been getting, even when I'm not posting videos. It's just really nice to get you guys to uh, interact, uh, particularly on Twitter. It's kind of fun to to just you know talk and all the conversations that go on there just cool um so make sure to follow me there i'll keep you posted i do um you know i do post some uh, gaming news and stuff like that there's some prospects that i might do a podcast uh here real soon with um with a friend of mine that he's a designer and stuff so you know that might not be interesting for some of you guys to to follow um let's see here so um, I think that I'll, I'll leave it at that. I won't take any more of your time. Um, this episode gets to show you uh, what I've been doing, the mineshaft stuff, but also the new intro. Um, if you guys like it, uh, make sure to send your feedback, like I said, and subscribe and all that stuff. Um, hope you're enjoying Ultra Hardcore with the Minecraft guys. I've, I, for, I certainly have. It's been a lot of fun. Um, and so, again, thanks. And I'll see you guys next time.